yo, V. How about a round or two? What do you say? Wait, who's talking to me? Is that, is that you? No, no, I'm just talking. Oh, who is talking to me? Wait, what the hell? She's huge. What the hell? <laughs> How you like my new punching bag? Just gave me a next-gen ass whooping he did. Be curious to see how he handles the likes of V. <laughs> uh, sure, why not? Let's do this. They put bolts on this so homeless people can't sleep on it. That's hilarious. What do you say? Wait, really? You mentioned something about fighting. I've seen you land in blows in the ring. You've got sharp instinct, good edge. You can go far, especially if you get chipped. These fights, let's just say they aren't legal, but very lucrative. Yeah, lucrative for who? You or me? Both of us. I get a small percentage of the total winnings, you know, as your agent. You get the rest. Um. Sounds fair. Sounds fair. It's like I said. Good instinct. Fights happen in different parts of the city. You choose where you want to go. Put down your eddies and start swinging. You win, you take home the pot. Manage to drop every last one of them, you get a chance to fight in the grand finale. That all clear? Crystal. Good. Oh, except you won't be setting foot outside or what? Not yet. You can start in Kabuki. I believe in you, V. Time to show this city what you're made of. Okay. I try to leave and I hit sit. <laughs> well, this is awkward because I was trying to get out of here. How do I leave? I'll get up. NPCD scanner hustles. The NPCD will pay you to help fight crime. Sick. Gigs. Fixers will contact you to approach a gig's location. Uh. <laughs> I got the cop is just, he's giving them a ticket for loitering while there's an armed individual. Man of the hour. Ah. Jeez, took you long enough. Took an appetite, just waiting. All right, Jackie, what's up, man? I mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet-ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but... Just that he's fronted by a little-known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat-ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold-plated cool. What's so the what's job? The gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal, he's riding on you now, is he? Why me? Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. Oh, Dex says he needs to check you. Talk to you. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice then. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is a league of his own. Not really. Not really, no. It's always the same story. You land on fresh turf, local fixer waves his dick around, but he's smiling, saying you'll be up to your neck in gigs and eddies. Still, all you are is another name in their little black book. Nifty tool for getting them a fat slice of whatever half-baked shit pie their client put on the table. Sure, you crack jokes over drinks, but in the end, it's biz. Gracias a Dios. Estoy lleno. China! Put your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our, uh, dust-up with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. 
Much appreciated. Some top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. All right, factory new. Chat, I, wait, I'm sick. Look at him butt slide the car. First stop, Ripper Duck and Holmes. Easy on the gas, huh? I just ate. Yeah, this is All it. All right. Come on, V. But you are not the masters of your memories. For your eyes do not belong to you, or rather, not only to you. Do you truly Wait, is that believe those who have sold you your mechanical <laughs> eyes have resisted the temptation to move through them? <laughs> Cameras are all around us, even within us. Your joys, your work, your life. That's it is so mere funny, spectacle. dude. That's so funny. That's amazing. You suggest I gouge out my implants? Do you truly believe? That those who have sold you your mechanical eyes have resisted the temptation to peek through them? Cameras are all around us, even within us. Your joys, your worries, your life. For them, it is all mere spectacle. Let's just dude, say that's right. amazing, dude. So what? Should I just gouge out my optics? Thanks, but no thanks. You are beyond salvation, but not the children of the future. Life untainted by surgery of the sacrilege. We can yet save them. Dude, this is May amazing. The shield their bodies. May the fathers instill their hatred for Crow. Dude, I want to be in a video game. That's amazing. Every step That's so funny. Ask, why the titans of entertainment in Alpha Centauri? In their wretchedness, they placate their weary and oppressed masses by putting our laughter, our tears, on full oh display! God. Look, a real conspiracy guy. Like in that show. Wait, get next to him. A step still to a rest from your government secret. Open your mind before it is too late! <laughs> I was trying to punch him, hold on. <laughs> Jessica will like die with Jesus. Like, this is Nova. Can you punch him? Hold on. It doesn't let you punch him. It won't let you punch Radio him. Radio waves bear the truth. Let those with ears listen. Oh. I was trying to punch him. I doesn't let you punch him. You deserve that. <laughs> <laughs> A step still if you are arresting him for a government. Co, thank you for the 20 months. <laughs> Open your mind before it is too late. Go, Carnage, thank you for the 20 months. I didn't deserve that. I want to see what let me punch you. It doesn't let me punch you. I just can't. That's so funny. This is my first time playing this. This is great. Is there any more dialogue with him yet or no? Dr. Vector will see you now. I'll sit tight Quite over here. Later? Okay, okay. Yeah, I missed to get a little kitchen up to do. You look pleased. Cause I am. Always. Makes for easier living. But... We got a new job lined up. From a big hitter at the afterlife. Oh. Is it gonna be dangerous? Don't you worry, mi amor. We're bulletproof. Okay, I'm going to the river dock. Wait, is that cat? Pet the cat. Is there something you want, loser? Wait, she called me a loser? Uh. Wait, why does that kid have a gun? Is that a child? Mm. Oh. What the heck is happening? You know what would be crazy? If whenever you... Wait, what? Wait, what? What? What the... The frick? Why are the cops shooting into a crowd of civilians? You're in a crime scene? I thought it was like a hologram. I thought it was a video. Yeah, Anahoth, I might be coming to a Tennessee game this year. For tailgate, by the way. So we uh, we might see you there. Oh come on! Get in. 
Okay. Gelato Steel, name of the tier one. Yo, Mr. V, a pleasure. Uh, the pleasure's all mine. Sean in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. <laughs> just, ask you something the car starts and just like Rick Ross starts playing. Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all time in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? Mm. Is this some kind of test? Is some sort of test? Eh, just a pet topic of mine. You mean riddles? No, Mr. I have asthma. Why are you Ontology. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. The job? Wait, why meet me? Why the show? Hang on. I got a question of my own now. Why all this? Oh, Anna, tier three me? upgrade. Thanks, dude. Could have had Jack here, t three sitting oh. here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past. And Sweet T-Bug helped this brother out two years ago. So here we are. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you. But we'll get to that. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Job's to grab it. Simple. Yeah. <laughs> Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Uh... Hello? I'm thinking! That's a death sentence. No, no problem. Just a death sentence. NC's yeah, Arasaka's okay. turf. Nobody fucks with them here. What can I say, Mr. V? High risk, high reward. First rule of the afterlife. Besides that, I'm no leadhead. Ain't gonna leave no trace for them to follow because we're gonna do this clean and on the hush hush. We understand each other. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, to rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Client, tell me about her. Uh, Mr. V? Client, what's your thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. I'm used to reading the options because of Baldur's Gate. Hades but the word out, I was looking I guess I don't have to read them anymore, do I? Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End the convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Shy Louise? Slot in the shard. Oh, I thank you. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, Convoy was carrying the Flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. Slabhead? And I need me that bit of high-grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat-out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shit from one Meredith Stout of military has from. developed an interest in said convoy. Corpo, woman's a corp agent. Corpo agent, what's she playing at? Hell if I know. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Sounds like she was waiting on the transport. Got stood up. Monochrome in the back's probably her chief suspect. Got nothing from him or on him. So she's keeping him just in case. 
She needs to find the stolen gear before her bosses learn she fucked up. Well, Mr. V, that is some impressive deduction. Naturally, use that intel as you please. Preferably well. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. You know all I need, I think. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. One more thing, Mr. V. Yes. Quiet life or blaze of glory. Mm. Later now. Hello, guy. Do we have to wait to give us up? You don't have to. Welcome to the stream. You could do it now. So you can either do a tier one and a gifted, or you can do two gifted. Tier one plus one gifted or two gifted sub for in-game sniper. Like we have 400 meters. Go to Lizzie's bar between 6 p.m. and 6 a.m. So right now it's 4.33. Wait, did I bump into her? We're getting mad at me? Can I steal this bike? Oh, I can. Wait. Shoot you guys, it was an accident. Can't do that. Oh, oh. Ah. Ah. It's not no, it's a, it's a misunderstanding. <laughs> Officer. No! No, I hit F. I hit F to talk to him. I meant to hit F to talk to him. And then I hit F again to kill <laughs> 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 I was trying to hit F to cancel, but it's F to kill. <laughs> I did not mean to do that. <laughs> okay, you know what? We're just gonna. How do I get out of combat? Get a ride? Hey, okay. Am I getting the passenger side? What? No, I didn't mean to. Wait, where'd the other guy go? Wait, the door didn't even open. Oh no. This is a huge misunderstanding. Like I. Suspect's vehicle has been located. Details have been sent. Oh. What the hell? <laughs> the FBI is here. Hit. We're closed right now. You're closed? Wait. They just stopped. What the hell? They just gave up. Dude, this game is hilarious. Shut up, idiot. <laughs> Looking a little put out there, input. Interest you in a pre and BD? What is BD? Not my first time. Don't remember you. Because I didn't get in through the front. Ha, huh, get a load of this one. Brain dance. Right. Rules are simple. Someone catches your eye, you do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. No recording, no cop and feels when the guards ain't looking. In you go. Have fun, input. Welcome to Lizzie's. Oh, look at that. Look, you can play Come with these. In. Going in or stand out? I'm playing with this. My, what a sweet little face you have. Safe area. Okay, so I can't punch here. Hey. Hey. Get you something. Does Lizzie still work here? So, curious. 
the name Lizzie's. Is that the owner? Not for a long while, no. And it's none too sweet a story. Now I'm just flat interested. Real Lizzie ran a strip joint out of this place back in the day. Lizzie's bar. The girls were paid right, insured, even had decent security. Good spot all in all. Until? Let me guess. It didn't last? No. Tiger Claws took care of that. Tiger beat one of Lizzie's girls real bad ones. No hesitation, Lizzie blasted the guy's balls off. As from the snack. Liz was done. Tigers gave this place up to the Mox in the end, though, didn't they? Sort of. The Moxes had to make a deal with them. Luckily, they kept their heads organized quick. The big boss now is Susie Q. But the sign stayed up, out of respect. And biz booms to this day. Well, I'm looking for Evelyn. I'm looking for Evelyn Parker. You know if she's here? Who's asking? A big tipper. Do I give him a big tip? A big tipper. Generous when I get the answers I'm looking for. Appreciate the gesture. Truly. But afraid I don't get paid to talk. Opposite, actually. It's all right, Mateo. I was waiting for this one. Who's that? Evelyn Parker. I knew it was you. I it? can't rotate my neck enough. I have freaking neck problems in game. Drink. Mm, my tequila of choice. Since on, only tequila I drink. <laughs> How do you know? I like to know everything about the people I work with. Either that or it was just a lucky guess. Why meet here? Wait, what is that six? Why are we meeting here? Any particular reason? Actually, it doesn't seem much like your thing, this place. Mm hmm. Hmm. I'll take that as a compliment. Come on. Yeah, it was no like, it looks like after your science. Where ears won't prick up to listen. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone asks, we're not here. Thank you, Mateo. Indubitably. So, oh, Evelyn, the VIP room. What Nothing's wrong. Really? Why don't you just tell me the truth? I just told you. V? Sorry. Here's what I've got. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. Yes, but I, I hope he wasn't smoke. overselling. Wait, how come everybody in the future smokes so much? I feel like in the future you would know that smoking is bad. Um, I'm waiting. Look, I'm the best. What can I say? I'm good at what I do. Got a solid crew on my back, too. Never once botched a job. You do realize I expect more of you than scraping so street corner me. data terms. Much, much more. By the way, you work together long? You and Dex? Um... What, are you writing Dex's bio? You writing Dex's bio? Hate to disappoint, but I just don't know much. In other words, you hardly know each other. Yet he fingered you for this job. Hmm. Huh? Curious. Uh... Look, if you got any doubts, just ring Dex. Shit, buzz Dex right now if you're getting cold feet. I can wait. I doubt he'd add anything I haven't already heard. Anything I'd really like to hear, for that matter. There's only one other bunch that's worse than fixers in that respect. Used car salesmen. I'll go with my gut for now. Okay, well, let's talk business. Let's cut to the Watch chase. Watch the door. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka, making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? I'm familiar with the franchise. Arasaka seems to have quite the touch with that hotel chain. It's franchise move. Say, Compeki in Tokyo still leagues above the rest. The two are identical to each other. Japan staff, huh? The service can't be beat. 
Singapore, Paris, Washington. All the rest act like charity case cousins by comparison. Well, hey, what the heck? She has her ashtray in, uh, in her hand. Where's this chip hiding exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? Ah, uh, I got City. to. <laughs> Guess the scream sheets weren't lying this time. It's on the lips of everyone in the city. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son, heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire, in town. <laughs> Please. Could it be? Emperor's prepared to cede his throne after 150 years? Hey, Spondu! Only a handful of people in Night Yo, City know what want? the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Seriously? That guy's my target? So we're not jumping the corp. We're jumping Yorinoba Arasaka himself. Yorinobu is a puppet. He lost all his cards years ago when he failed to do daddy's bidding. Saburo's had Yori's balls in a vice for years. He might just turn the screw and crush them outright if he learns his son's up to no good again. Even so, it's still Yorinobu fucking Arasaka. <laughs> Yorinobu did what to Arasaka? <laughs> no, that's his name. Oh. Now uh, this should make your prick perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch. Aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Where does Yorinobu keep the relic? Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now, where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. Cyberpunk! On the outside, I it looks know like her. an ordinary briefcase. And the case is. That's not how that, that's how yourself, that phrase Sina, works. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. It's damned. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. I think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits, jacking off to in those boxes. Wait, no. what? It can be a very useful tool. Good for analyzing details, human perception, even boosted, doesn't grasp. Would exactly you what you need. Like anything else? So what's on the tape? You left your wallet? Gordy Nobu Suite. The glorious interior. Oh, I left my wallet. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hey. We weren't finished. Oh, my bad, my bad, my bad. Okay. Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? No, no objections. No, not at all. Let's see this brain dance. Judy will help. She's a mox, too. Besides, we go back, uh, years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So, you'll be a good boy, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. Gotcha, biz, Judy. You don't gotcha girls, okay? Gotcha is not used for women. That is inappropriate. <clears throat> Yo, your father's luck. There you are. This is V. Is it? He's it's here for that BD role. <laughs> and V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. You're gonna make me barf. Got quite the, the setup here. Setup. Need all this to process brain dances. Mm-hmm. Analyzers, sensory SIG amps, acoustic and emotive wave monitors, facial expression translators. <clears throat> Judy. All right, all right. Compiled your BDF. What do you think? Will it do? It's still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to him. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. You should see the jig-jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? What the hell? Is this a streamer? Look at her setup. Uh, what's so raw about it? What do you mean by raw? How's this differ from the ready-mates? Huh. 
Ready-mades, provided they're well-made, should feed you feelings and impressions you'd never have the chance to experience yourself in real space. But it's mass-market shit, so it's pre-crafted, hard-coded, fenced-in, and manageable. A raw one? Well, it's more like a virtue in Viro. You get to move around, look at things in detail. Editors use those layers to fish for juicier emotes and impulses, then use them to pad the BDs that go to market. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. Oh my gosh, look at this, dude. This looks like the classic, like you have an office chair and you haven't replaced it in like five years. You know what I mean? Like I think I bought this chair at Walmart and I haven't replaced it in like five or six years. Gotta create your sensory profile first. Uh, a what profile? A what profile now? A model of your perceptions and emotional responses. Need to adjust that so the raw BD won't overwhelm you. If I don't, best case scenario, you'll get nauseous as soon as you're in. Probably barf like you would in a shoddy virtue enviro. Mm-hmm. And worst case? Your synapses sizzle like locusts in a deep fryer. But we're not about to let that happen. Nah. -uh. Uh, okay. Profile away. Okay. Hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Be but diving in. in. <laughs> Plan hey. simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. On you go. Uh, okay. Uh, everybody, on the ground. I want to see you kissing the flooring. Money, now, or I will fucking drop you. I swear to God. Whoa, yeah, hey, uh, uh, now. Before I blow your fucking head off! Ah! Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. What the heck? You could have warmed me. Warned me. That flash of intense shock. I can still feel it, I remember. Fuck, that last second. You could have warned me how much it hurts to die. Trust me, real death hurts much, much more. Not so sure about that. Does dying hurt? Or do you just kind of, does it just kind of happen? I'll sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. Whole scene's yours. Full cam control and analysis mode. So move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So, analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the Plan editor simple. console to odd. unpause. Don't get Try creative. It. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Rewind. Roll it back to the top. Wow. Hey V, what's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Compecky Plaza. It's a brain dance. Compecky? Oh, thought as much. Someone there with you? Judy and Evelyn. Judy and Evelyn, they're chill. They're helping me work through this BD. Uh-huh. All right. You gonna tell me what this is about? Listen, need your help. Got no clue what to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request now. Got it. You ready? A millisec. Okay. You're ready over 9001. Give it the tier one. Ice and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire up, Judy. <laughs> Yeah. 
Flashbang. All right, V. Eyes open. Gotta find out where Yurinobu's keeping the relic. You look like a cut and fuckable. Terminator? Are you? <laughs> Evelyn. She. I felt her fear. <laughs> sure got it under control quick, too. I said no. They'll have my head for this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, okay, so let me let me go back here. Let me let me uh, let's check the clues. <laughs> Military grade cyberware, motion sensor camera. Shit, camera's packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. So cybernetic modifications means that it's like 96% means 4% human, extreme danger. You look like a cut. Fuck. Alarm system. Alarm firmware's fresh, but saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds fall into this sieve. Let me generate keys. I can forge their six. Said no. One. I said no. Then. Here in a drone, ventilation and cooling, servers, gotta be. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute. To Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's a tired, visionless old gray beard who thinks nothing. Got my sniper? Nice. And he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we won't now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must no, provide them. If Heard that? Relic docs gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. Sorry to make you wait. Business can be stupid. Mm, it wasn't long. Not even long enough for me to grow bored. Is everything all right? Wait, what? Is what is happening? Edgy. A moment. It will pass. <sighs> I can get to work on that. Just one condition. You wish to make demands of me. Only one. Focus. On. Ah, automated turret. Automated turrets. Latest scanner model. Systems all connected to the server. Dude, there's so many freaking like wiener this. ads. <laughs> oh, okay, hold on. Scan results, Liberty. Ooh, Loaded. God. Sinky's on. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. Warui kome. I miss this. You. I know. Oh, okay. All the way over here. Hidden safe. Right. Grab the heat sig. Matches the spec in the docks. Oh. Yorinova's got the case here. Guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. Think we've heard about that, really? Please yeah, that's kind of out of the way for where your character is. Get everything you need? <sighs> yep, that'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. Nice work today. See What's you up, soon. Mark? Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. Portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Our so, way. what now? 
V. Do this job for me. I mean, me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone yeah. else. No middlemen. No decks. Um. So she is telling me Don't to betray Dex. Join. Go with your gut feeling. I mean, I feel like I shouldn't betray Dex. Why does she want me to betray Dex? That's what I want to know. Like, what, what's the deal here? You want to haze our fixer? Well, you want to fuck over our what do you fixer? Think? I knew something was up. Dex is a middleman. And a useless one at this point. Evelyn, you don't mess with fixers. That's the one rule every merc in this city knows. And actually follows. But if we're smart... Doesn't matter. A mistake like that will cost you your rep. And without a rep, you're nobody. You sure you want to do this? Better ask yourself that question. Do you want to spend the rest of your days blasting scabs? Or become a legend overnight? Your choice. I feel like typically I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't want to betray Be somebody, you know? But at the same time, maybe, maybe we play, maybe we play this one a little bit differently. I'll think about it. If I agree, there'll be hell to pay for sure. I know. Whatever you decide. Okay, thanks, Sam. That's between good, us. Good, that's good advice. I can offer 50%. Eddie's enough to do whatever the hell you like. I'll be finished. Dex won't forgive a dirt move like this. Dex isn't the only fixer in town. But my offer's the only one you'll ever get. <sighs> Let me think about it. Mm-hmm. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Good luck. Now go. I need a few words with Judy. How things looking, Mr. V? Oh, I'm looking Turns good. Everyone's recording from Compeki was worth our time. Beautiful. T-Bug already called. Said she's working her magic. And the flathead. Nothing yet. On it now. T-Bug says no chance of that ship without that bot. To work then, Mr. V.